Hi everyone, welcome to my new video. In this video I'll show you how you can make a pickup truck. It's a simple design. Of course, like each project begins, we'll start by cutting up the lumber and planing it square and flat. The main body of the pickup truck exists of two pieces of lumber. Now I can cut them into the right length. The top piece needs an angle, so carefully cut this on the miter saw. Here I'm drawing the shape of the window. Then I can cut it out on the bandsaw. I'm using the bandsaw slat to make sure I'm cutting in a straight line. Now I'm gonna cut the front and the back window. Be careful! The lower body of the truck can use some shaping. Oh, earlier I said the base exists of two pieces, but it exists out of three pieces. The base plate, the lower part and the upper part, which is the window. And again, this small belt sander comes in handy for these uh, tricky sides to sand by hand. Some pieces you still need to sand by hand, so I'm doing it with this sanding stick. Now it's time to glue it together. I'm using wood glue and some super glue. With a hole saw it's easy to make your own wheels. Drill them out and put them in your hand drill and then you can sand the corners smooth. For the pickup area of the truck, so I mean the back of the truck, I'm making small dowels, actually they are squares but I'm rounding um, the lower part so I can hammer it in the holes. Later on in the video you'll see what I mean. Now that the body is glued up, you can sand the edges smooth. Now 
Knock off the sharp corners on your belt sander. Drill four holes in the base plate for those little pearls I made earlier. Round over the sharp corners. Drill two 7mm axle holes. Let's glue the little poles in place. I had some thin strips laying around from one of my previous projects. So I decided this was great for the fences of the pickup truck. Glue the little slats in place and if you're not subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe. And of course, be before you glue them on, sand the edges smooth. Now we can glue the body in place. I'm using some scrap pieces at the side, so I can be sure I'm gluing it on the middle. To finish my pickup trucks, I'm using the beautiful colors of Rubio Monocoat. I'm coloring the body and the wheels separately and then I can glue them together once they're dry. Flush trim the axles and your truck is ready to ride. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in one of my new videos. Bye!